Live Gamer HD2 video capture card. This is just my first impressions, my remarks here for posterity. So um, I got this to stream more of my uh, older games um, on, on older consoles. So uh, GameCube, Wii. PlayStation 3 already has HDMI, which is great, because I'm going to be feeding the, the consoles through RetroTINK to this. Uh, so, now that we have a little bit of background, um, I got this kind of as a birthday present to myself. I'm going to take the plastic off because it's really hitting the light in an obnoxious way. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> The struggle begins. Oof. Gotta keep it super sealed. Nice and clean. Well, the cardboard's it's got a nice texture to it. Gotta say. And now you can really see the, uh, the glossiness of this. Oh my goodness. So fancy. And then this sticker. String yourself into the spotlight. Okay, I, I just... The, the jaded cynic in me comes out so much whenever I read that. I'm just questioning all my life decisions leading up to this point. It is a rabbit hole that I could just rant on and on about, so <laughs> I'm just going to have to move on from that. Oh god, that's so bad. Alright, so, ooh. Oh, it's so shiny. Let me just slide this out, or is this going to be an issue? Oh, God. There we go. More foil. And then we've got some foam here. It's like I'm cracking the, the spine on a good book or something. That's what it feels like. Pulling that apart. Can't keep it all in frame because I have the uh, camera lowered so you can actually see everything that's in here. Okay, I'm gonna put the frame, <laughs> the frame, words, the foam over there. This is our video card right here. And I like how simple I guess this card is. It's nondescript. You have a lot of these cards and cases, anything gaming, uh, anything like computerized that's related to gaming being like super over the top. Uh, and I like, I like this minimalistic look. Uh, it's got a nice design, but it also allows for airflow. So that's cool for me. I like that. It has a logo that looks like the Origin PC logo. <laughs> Kind of, yeah, so we have the uh, audio out and in, HDMI. It's very simple. But I heard with uh, the audio jacks, it can either only be HDMI or the audio. Like, you can't do both. So that kind of limits things. And then we have our cables. Oh, it comes with an HDMI cable. I've got so many of these now. And, like, it used to be VGA. And DVI, and you had so many of those, and now you got so many HDMI. I don't know what the quality is on this cable, um, but I'm sure it would be good enough for my purposes, even though I have plenty. <laughs> um, and this, oh, it looks like an audio cable. Yeah, that's, that's useful. No, your cable's useful. So, you know, extra cables for the cable box. And we have warranty extensions. Oh my goodness. Insider program. 
the manual. The quick guide. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> and all the languages you could ever want. Blah, blah, blah. And it covers the basics. I like how they have. Let's see. Yeah, I think that's Chinese and that's Japanese, right? I don't know. I could be wrong. <laughs> I'm just not seeing any Japanese characters as I'm glancing at this. So I don't. I can't tell. <laughs> the info packet. Why this couldn't go with the quick guide, I'm not sure, but there you go. Stream to victory. How about just stream because you want to create memories and connections with people? <laughs> and that's, that's it. Empty box. So that's all you really get in this. Um, and now I will, the, now that I've recorded the unboxing, I'll hook this up to the computer and test it out, and then um, I'll be able to use it for streaming on Twitch. Twitch.tv slash a lucky news. Ah. <laughs>
I did just do a recording where I'm going to test any lag in OBS and see how that works compared to uh, me saying that I'm pressing a button and one that actually triggers in the recording. But overall, it does seem to be working pretty nicely. Actually, I can kind of see in the spinning motion here. No, nope, it stopped. It stopped right when I tried to record them both. But yeah, so um, some, some testing on lag is what I'm going to be doing next. But overall, if you just want to stream stuff, it's not that hard to set up. Um, I did download a little program just to make sure that the drivers and the firmware were up to date. And they, they were. And after that, it's just selecting it in OBS doing the audio fix, and we're good to go. <laughs> so uh, thank you for watching all of that. Um, and as always, from my heart to yours, good luck. <laughs>